Alright, Neo Crips here. I'm gonna make this video. I finally got everything working right. Um, I had to find me a capture software to do this um, because all the ones that I had wasn't wouldn't let me stretch it to wherever I wanted to. I was using Softcam before, but this one here seems to work. It's called Hypercam. And uh, anyways, to get to the point, as you see today on here is July 20th, 2010. Now, if I move these around, you will see the Earth and the asteroid pretty much almost close to each other, but not quite close. They're more close. I believe it was on let's say it was the 25th. But it's it all depends on where you put this together at. Uh, I was saying it was somewhere around the 17th before, um, and 17th is when we had those really bad thunderstorms here in my area. Uh, some people in New York said they had them in their area as well. But I had several people asking me to make this video, so they knew what exactly I was talking about now this is not the exact part that I'm talking about those storms the other night was caused because it was real close but it wasn't exactly there now I'm not saying that it was just the storms other things could have happened on those days um, I heard from somebody else that uh, we had UFO sightings in either China or Japan uh, but this asteroid is so close if you look over here it's so close and the day that it's I would say really close was around what well, depends on where you kinda scroll to but it doesn't matter where you scroll to it matters how close it is um, well, I guess it does kind of matter where you scroll to. Um, I would say right there would be the best option because it's going around. So I would say the 24th and the 25th is pretty much the closest days. 24th and the 25th. That's the day it's closest. But if you go advanced ahead you keep on going until you get to I believe it was July 25th of 2015 they are neck and neck they are right on top of each other and I was telling a few people about this earlier and they said they didn't have job on their computer and uh, I think it would show me was wanting to show Dan this as well but I want to get this video out so I can show everybody because it, oh, it was so close to that Mercury a minute ago too. Not real close but kind of close. And if you guys see something that I don't see let me know because I've kind of watched this thing spin around a few times because I've been trying to get this video out but uh, all my capture software that I was trying to use wouldn't either the video wouldn't work or the audio wouldn't work and I finally found this uh, hypercam that actually worked for me and we're gonna get somewhere close to there soon oh, well it's gonna be a little bit but I will spin this all the way around for you and on like I said July 25th I think it was it was either 25th or the 23rd I keep getting my days mixed up because one of the days that I predicted was the 23rd but it's really on the 25th because I didn't spin it around before but this time when I spent it around all the way it was on the 25th and everything was just all connected on that day July 25th of Oh, I passed it, shit. Of 2015. You, you guys probably seen it already. 
that's alright. We'll just go back a little bit. And then I'll spin it around for you. Oh. Why do I keep passing it? Alright, and I had it something similar to that, I guess. Okay, now everything's freezing up on me. Okay. Now I'm going to just get it right on the date. There we go. July 15th. Okay. Now, you see they're right on top of each other, right? Is it July? No. Hold on a second. Alright. This thing's screwing up on me or something. Because I've played this so many times. Oh. I don't have everything lined up like I should have. Alright. Let's get it back to where it's supposed to be. Then back her up. Alright, there we go. I see it. Alright, now. Right there. Earth and the comet. Perfectly lined. Any way you spin it around. See, right there. Spin it around this way. they're combined and there's no fixing this I did not fix this like I said you guys can go to this website and I'll show you that there here in a second as well if I can move this thing around I should be able to move it well like I said I'll, I'll just put the link in in the below bar there on YouTube to show you guys but when you get to that date, you can actually do the same thing. You can take these scroll bars and flip them around. And you can see what I'm talking about. But yeah, check that out. And I thought I'd share that with all of you guys because you guys have been asking for it. and You've been very patient about it. And um, it just, it was time. It, I couldn't get it out fast enough because I couldn't find the right software. But uh, there it is, guys. Neocrypt's out.